What got me started in music uh, was just basically writing poems and lyrics as a kid. I went to a concert, a psychopathic show in Birmingham, and uh, that's when I knew I wanted to do music right then and there, you know, and, and shit, it's just escalated from there. My musical influences are anything from old school 70s rock and roll, southern rock, all the way up to metal to fucking hip hop, man. I mean, you're talking about Metallica, Pantera, Led Zeppelin, Eagles, motherfucking uh, Tupac, uh, Bone Thugs and Harmony. I mean, it's just a whole fucking world of music that has influenced me, but real hip hop is where my influence is at, man. I, I spit hip hop, but my fucking, my roots lie in metal and hard rock. No, I ain't never really felt like giving up. Uh, back uh, about 10 years ago or so, my ex-wife uh, stole like $40,000 worth of fucking studio equipment out of my crib and I was forced to retire out of music for about eight years. Uh, I never felt like giving up, I just didn't have the means to do my music until I met Nikki 256 aka Nick Langley with Diverse Sounds Entertainment, man. That man has shown me so much love. I mean, that's my motherfucking brother right there, you know what I'm saying? He's actually helped me discover myself as an artist again. He's helping me do all kinds of shit. So, you know, much love to Nikki 256 um, Shit, I got all kinds of shit I'm working on, man. I mean, there's a lot of tracks. I got The Last of Us theme. I built a track around. Uh, there's a preview of a track that I'm finna release. We're shooting a video for here momentarily. We're gonna start shooting. Um, you know, I, where I see myself is just still rocking the motherfucking mic, you know what I'm saying? I don't see myself, like, muck, making millions of motherfucking dollars yet. I just hope I can get a little bit of motherfucking attention and some support from the motherfucking lows and lets out there, you know what I'm saying? Because the underground, where it's at, um, I ain't going to be selling out to no mainstream bullshit if that's what you're asking. Uh, but, yeah, that's where I see myself, man. I'm going to continue to rock the fuck on for my motherfucking juggalos.